Good morning, Facebook. Happy Monday. Jana Jones here off of I-4. Unfortunately, this morning, a tractor trailer that was carrying sweet potatoes caught fire. You can still see it smoking behind me right there. I want to emphasize that the driver is okay. He pulled over whenever he realized there was a mechanical problem. He safely got out of the truck. We have learned he's a 62 year old man from Orlando. So the good news this morning is, is that the driver is okay, but this is going to cause some big traffic backups for your Monday morning commute. This is around mile marker 33. Uh, there's one lane of traffic getting by. I'm not sure if you guys can see that here, but there's some alternative routes. I want you to tune in to WFLA Meredith. She's giving you the best route to take. She's been telling people to take the Polk Parkway instead of this option right here, I-4, because obviously these westbound lanes, only one of them is open right now. So let me show you that truck again. You can see it back there. It's very, very mangled. Very obviously it caught fire, so it's completely damaged. And right now there are two big trucks here that are working to figure out a way to tow it and move. But as you can see, just want everyone to know that I-4 is going to be a bit of a backup this Monday morning. So I'll just see if you guys have any questions and just give you a live view of what we're seeing out here right now. And good morning to those of you who are just joining us. Early this morning around 5.10 a.m., this tractor trailer that was carrying sweet potatoes had some mechanical issues. The driver realized that and pulled off to the side of the road and safely got out of the truck. So he is okay. He's a 62 year old man from Orlando, but obviously this truck is not okay and causing some big backups right now on I-4. This is the westbound lanes that you're looking at right now. One lane of traffic is able to get by. So that's I guess some positive news, our traffic reporter Mer Meredith Sensulo will be able to direct you better. You can follow us along on WFLA traffic on Twitter or as well we're on air right now on Channel 8 and then in just a few minutes we'll be on Great 38. We'll be keeping you guys updated on this all morning long. So again, this is around mile marker 33. I know it's still dark out here right now, so I'm not sure if you can see, but the front of the truck, the cab is disconnected because it was so badly burned. And right now we're waiting for these tow trucks to figure out a way to get this mess cleaned up and so people can get by on their morning commute. But again, one lane of traffic is open. Again, that is westbound around mile marker 33. Right, guys I have to go get ready for a live shot I will keep you updated on this situation all morning long you can follow us on air and also our Meredith and Sulo has the best routes for you this morning follow her on Twitter at uh, WFLA traffic and of course whenever this anything changes out here or gets cleared up I will be sure to give everyone an update hope you all have a safe and good Monday it's kind of scary out here on the side of I-4 so just everyone drive safe and make it a good day